Hey y'all and welcome back to the party. It's me, your girl Britt Reacts, and today we are reacting to Led Zeppelin When the Levy Breaks. This is a special request from my Patreon members. Hey besties. Um we have a ton of fun over on Patreon, you guys. So much fun. So if you would like to check it out, check the description in this video or on the About Me page on my channel. Without further ado, let's see what they have to say. Love the countdown. <laughs> Serious question. What is that? Like, is it a balloon? Is it a missile? It reminds me of the the the, the movie Up, the Disney movie Up or Pixar movie. Uh, the thing that the guy, I can't remember what his name was, but he's the one who had all the dogs that talked. He was traveling on that. What is this? What is that? That is so cool. Like, it's like an air balloon submarine. <laughs> Go ahead and tell me in the comments what it actually is. I'm just super intrigued. Goodness. And I love, I mean, the dun -dun 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 -dun, like what? Rock star lifestyle might don't make it. Like this is so good. the Hindenburg so is this object called the Hindenburg I feel like y'all are going to educate me so much on this one because I'm already look at all the confusion on my face the con I am confusion <laughs> I'm confusion I'm confusion I'm confusion is this also real life is this like real life documentation of this vessel is what I feel like is more appropriately uh, a way to address such a massive thing floating in the air? I have so many questions. It's huge. It's huge. Guys, is, just, is this just an instrumental? Patreon fam, is this just an instrumental? You guys. <laughs> You guys know I was going to stop this and mention those purple silk pants he had on in like the first clip of the stage performance. Uh, I need them. Thank you. Secondly, um, anytime I hear the word levy, I immediately think of Hurricane Katrina because it was the first time I ever like heard of a levy or what it was and it breaking and the magnitude of destruction that can happen when a levy breaks. And so that's like immediately where my mind goes to when I'm thinking like, of the setting or just the illustration of the song and you know to think if it rains too hard the levee's gonna break it's like yeah that's exactly what happens so I'm I'm like now so excited to see where this song goes and what the um maybe uh metaphoric meaning of this levee breaking means or is it just truly <clears throat> excuse me a frog jumped down my throat just now or if we're really talking about a levee breaking no place to stay. No place. That's nice. Place to stay. Need a lady. Come in a wind and moan. Need a lady. Come in a wind and moan. Need a lady. Stay. 
stop. This might be the first Led Zeppelin song that I've heard and reacted to her on this channel where I actually feel like I understand. I feel like most of her songs have been so like um, elusive and like metaphoric that like my little 1998 brain is just not catching on. <laughs> Did I say 1998 or 1988? Because I'm in 88 and I pointed to, yeah, anyway. Um, but I feel like I can understand this, the meaning of this a little better. Uh, as we keep digging in, but I love that. Stop that. That's good. It's got what it takes to make a mountain man leave his home. Is that what I heard? Which, I mean, makes sense if the levee breaks. Clear the way. Eva evacuate. Get out of the way. Okay, shout out to the Patreon fam because clearly you guys know me. I love this song. This is my favorite Led Zeppelin song I've listened to thus far. By far. I mean, best one. My Patreon fam did not fail me. Shout out to you guys. Oh my gosh. It's so good. The lead singer really sings from such a sensual place. And I don't mean that like overtly sexual. I just mean like he's very, like he could, he could feel, he almost like feels the music through every fiber of his body from his fingertips. Like he's always moving kind of like really sensually. Like it just feels like his, he's, he's, sens he's, he's feeling it. Like the sensations are taking over his body. And you can like see that when he performs live. And all the th all the songs I've seen him perform, he has that same movement quality, and I just like love that. I'm like, oh no, he's he feels every every word, every note, every part of the song. He feels it. Look at that! Look at that! Okay, so those are humans flying this this vessel. What is that called? I'm just gonna go with air submarine until y'all correct me in the comments. Who am I hurting? No one, right? We're gonna go with air submarine. <laughs> that thing is massive. No, those type of things give me like the major heebie-jeebies, like that things, structures that are that massive, I would like have some type of attack. Oh my gosh. I can't even do, like stand next to like a really big water slide, y'all, without feeling like, <laughs> like I have one of my really good friends, she works on the tarmac at, at, at an airline. She's done it for years. She's always taking pictures like inside the, the, What's the thing with the, the like, you know, the propeller. She's always, like, inside there taking, like, really cool pictures. I'm like, no, things that are make me feel this small, just looking at this. So it is called the Hindenburg. This is so cool. I feel like I'm getting, like, a history lesson and a really good song. Look at them reeling it in. He just jumped out? <laughs> oh my god. What's that? 
What was that fluid? What was that fluid? Because I mean, if people were housed in this thing, what was that fluid? Sheesh. <laughs> <laughs> I just made myself choke <coughs> <coughs> like about the fluid oh gosh sorry y'all stress me out <coughs> Woo. May 6th the giant mistress <laughs> you gotta move, Mama. Oh, woo. Okay, though I understand what they're saying about the levee breaking and mama, you have to move. I'm not sure what we're referring to. So yes, let me know in the comments. Thank you. Still choking, by the way. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just would love for y'all to tell me like what does the Hindenburg and what look to be like clips of them touring the world on different stages and stuff on their airplane, which is so cool. They had their own airplane back then. Like what? And the levee. <clears throat> just trying to understand. They just seem to be a little bit deeper than I can go. Like, I don't know if I have the ability to like really get as deep as Led Zeppelin is. You know what I mean? Or is it just not that serious? Do they just make music? Like I know I've said this before in another Led Zeppelin comment or video that someone commented. I don't even think Led Zeppelin knew what their music was about. They were just going off vibes. And that's also could be the thing. They were just writing music that felt good to the soul at the time. And that's also fine. I just want y'all to clarify for me. Thank you. Thank you. Serene. You just say go to Chicago, dust the Hindenburg mirrors. It's mooring mast. What does that mean? It's so close to the building. It's so close. Going down now. No one was going to warn me that this thing was going to burst into flames. <gasps> Oh my gosh. What did I just watch? No way. 
oh, I need an explanation. What the even heck just happened? That is so sad. There's people on. Okay. All right. What happened? And them singing going down, going down now. Just, I mean, just changed. Just, oh, Jesus. like disintegrating is this something I should have learned about in history class And now I'm just wondering, like, does the levy have to do, just like the pressure of something so big, eventually it will break, meaning like that thing was so massive that eventually, I mean, it disintegrated in a matter of seconds. It went from being this ginormous structure to literally a pile of fire. That is the saddest thing. All right. Y'all let me know what I just watched, please. I love the song. I genuinely love the song. So shout out to you guys on Patreon because you guys know me and you picked a really good song. But the visual you could have warned me about, friends, besties, what's going on? Oh my gosh. Okay. All right. Have the day you deserve. Peace.